What's up, guys? Video number three of the day. Uh, so, this one, well, if you can tell from the title, we're going to be changing out the front brake pads. And Jesus Christ, look at that rest back there. Anyway, um, that really got me off my train of thought. Anyway, uh, as you see, the wheels still over there unpainted. But we're going to be taking off this caliber and brake pads and I already sprayed with brake clean. So first thing first you're gonna need a 13. Okay. That 13 ain't working. Yeah, look at that kneecap, huh? And this video is really just that simple. Two bolts and your brake pads are on the ground. Now for me, I'm not done. Uh, we're gonna go to the other side, we'll go ahead and show you how to decrease the clamp on the front. I showed you the back and it was very oh shit the wall's flying on my head. Anyway, let's go over here. I sprayed this rotor black clean already. Uh, the brake is back here. I just painted it. Let's get this bracket in. Fuck when I'm on the back step. Okay, got that bracket in. Uh, and since my brakes were screaming and I couldn't find, never find out why, I'm gonna go ahead and add some uh, brake lubricant. Uh, just to the back of the pad, and it doesn't have any of the other hardware stuff that it's telling you to put it on, so I'm just gonna put it all over the back. Shit. I know I squeeze it open.
and the caliper on these are easy to press in. All you need is one of the old brake pads. And your C-clamp. Let me scoot you guys over so you can see it actually. Let me zoom in so you guys know what to be looking for. It's just pressing like any other car. And there it is. And that guys is pretty much how you uh do the front brake pads on the Jaguar X type. It wasn't no need to bleed them or anything like that. But there, here it is. Let's get it all buttoned up. And uh, we'll go for a test drive on all four brakes. And I just changed the rear and I just changed the front. So we need to see what's going on. See you guys in the car.